It's Fiesta Week here in San Antonio with several different festivities in and around town. But for Spurs followers, and they are passionate, they're thinking about a big championship parade at the end of June and a potential fifth title for their beloved Spurs. Game one today between the Utah Jazz and the San Antonio Spurs. Hey, they need this pace to be slow. They need to muck this game up. They lay off the Derek Favors, and he returns the favor, knocking down the jump shot. Al Jefferson still on the bench. Favors inside. Carroll over to Tinsley and Favors again, working against Bonner. And another good result. I'll tell you what, this guy is just growing by leaps and bounds. And how Burks. Favors with a deft pass inside to Paul Millsap. Antonio looking for the push. And a great block inside by Favors on Duncan. And Duncan losing the handle. A three-on-one for the Jazz. Burks. And he gets it to fall. Utah hanging in, Doris Burke. And a two-on-one for San Antonio. Parker snuffed at the rim by Favors. Jackson. Spurs missing opportunities. Favors the other way, plus the foul. And Bonner goes down hard. Favors is up, and now Blair comes over to assist Matt Bonner. So a Favors taking the ball, there may be contact right there with the right leg of Favors into the right leg of Bonner. And that's what Bonner's feeling the pain from down on the ground. Mills playing in 16 games, averaging better than 10 points. Favors on the glass over Blair. It's been just remarkable. Derek Favors. Diaw. Extra pass on the outside, and Favors takes it away. Big time block. And knocked out of bounds, it's going to be Utah ball. How about Derek Favors? You see the interior passing ability of Boris Diaw. Splitter looks like he's going to finish it with the two-hand dunk. Derek Favors says, no way. Spins around. Here's Gordon Hayward. Favors underneath. And how about... The 20-year-old in his second season at a Georgia Tech. Started nine games this season for the Jazz. Here's Favors on the block guarded by Blair. Backing him down. Spinning end line. Wow. Favors has really grown. I saw him come in as a rookie. Favors, six points, five rebounds. We'll go back to the matchup. His own rebound goes in strong, and he's fouled. This is the most aggressive I've ever seen Favors in a game of basketball in the NBA. I mean, they have gotten this young man fired up for tonight's game. You'll see the post-up. Cutter goes through. Now, Blair is smaller, but watch this. After the first shot, you've got to go get him. That time, the turnaround goes in. Just Lee talked about how this is a team that really gets their energy off of their offense. And it's not their defense that gets it on Facebook. Favors gets the second. Favors. Back to Burks. Cantor. Favors over Duncan. And a timeout taken by Greg Popovich as a Utah Jazz a battle back. On a 6-0 run. You'll see the energy on the inside. Cantor going after it. Favors going after it. The two youngsters providing the toughness and energy on the interior. 6-0 run by the Jazz. On a repost to Favors. Favors one time on the floor. And 
And it ain't a run now by the Jazz. Favors knows that he has such an advantage over Bonner. Once he gets it down in that six-foot area away from the rim, he just shoots it up over the top of Bonner. Favors his first career double-double in the postseason. Parker right to the rim. And they're going to count the bucket. Well, one thing Derek Favors does is he gives them somebody that can protect the rim. And there you see Favors come along. The crowd feels that it was a good block. Comes up empty. Harris. Favors. Derek Favors in traffic. Making sure that no one was going to block that field goal attempt. Watch the young athletic Favors. Once he gets the drop down pass, he knows that Tim Duncan's right next to him. He's going to make sure he finishes it without Duncan getting a block. And still filing in here to Energy Solutions Arena. Derek Favors right to the rim. Remember, he told us he is so talented. He works so hard. He said what he needs right now, he needs one post-up move, kind of like a go-to move to get him started as far as his post-game goes. Who's ringing out for Parker and a block by Derek Favors. Splitter underneath, going against Favors. Favors corrals it. The Dr. O'Neill area. Well, he controlled it for enough years, didn't he? Splitter! Oh, my! Derek Favors! And unable to connect at the other end. This is where Splitter has to realize Favors is going to be there. Make the next pass. He's got a wide-open teammate sitting in the right-hand corner. That's where Favors came from. Tinsley and Burks. Favors. Nice job on a duck in. And he gets fouled. Talked to Tyrone Corbin about Derek Favors. He said one of the things that really helped out was you know, him finally getting comfortable. And Kevin O'Connor, the general manager, and Tyrone Corbin actually had went and visited with him in Atlanta. And Parker one of five to begin game four. Clock at five. Down to four on the shot clock. To three on the shot clock. Duncan fouled. Favors. San Antonio since 1999. The arrival of Tim Duncan. They are 24 in nine in closeout games. Harris gives it to Favors in the lane. Uh, when he came down after the block and Gary Briggs trainer. Utah. Came down you know, with all his weight on that right foot. Energy and activity. But he got it from behind. That's where the outlet pass, you'll see it right here. That right there, he reached in and deflected that outlet pass. That's how Tinsley was able to come up with it. And then Hayward driving, denied by Duncan. Favors powers his way through. And that's with Tim Duncan getting a hand on that ball when he went to shoot. He still was able to convert. Favors. Pick and roll with a spin move. Rolls right into contact. And a foul. You don't want to miss it. Conan, all new tonight at 11 10 Central. Only on speaking to Tyrone Corbin that he mentioned about the low post moves. He said you could ask him seven times and he'd give you seven different answers as to which is his go to move in the post. Sometimes you have to ask a player just to see what they're <laughs> thinking is like, where do you really want? San Antonio trying to end it tonight. Favors. He is fouled and favors crossover Harris. His favors with a jumper, sticks it. He's got 13. 8 0 run now. It's for Neal, three and double figures off of the bench. And favors and Duncan collide. Antonio 26 favors. Good with the first. Here comes Tony. Parker, Ginobili, and Jackson for San Antonio. And a foul as Tony Parker ends up in the second row. Right over Scott Layden, assistant coach. Gives it to Harris. Favors comes and sets the screen. Rolls to the rim. And a foul. Duncan and Jackson were there. Jackson. Foul was on Jackson. And Favors, 7 of 11 from the free throw line. In his first playoff start, coming off of a double-double in game three. At 15 points and 11 rebounds. And gets both here. 
83-77, a two-possession game. For many of these young Utah Jazz players, the first time that they've made it to the postseason, but it ends in a sweep. The San Antonio Spurs sweep the Utah Jazz, 87-81.